青コーナー百九十五センチ百三点二キロアウスタオーフレームアウスタデモリッションマンオーバリーム is twenty five six five two hundred twenty eight pounds six and three in pride 十四。You know, Alistair's got the reach advantage. I hope he's going to pick his shots. That's very important. And of course, conditioning and pacing. Alistair Overeem coming out right away. Both of them test the waters with the strikes. We've said it. It's been well documented, boss. Alistair Overeem with all the tools, but conditioning has been his Achilles heel. Yeah, he really should stay just out of his reach. Oh, look at this beautiful nice stick. Nice down into side control. He, now he really has to pace himself. He cannot. He's got to take his time. Knee to the head. Known for his famed knee strikes. Of course, Heratonov, a Sambo champion in Russia. Comfortable from the bottom. But Alistair Overeem in good position now and delivering some elbows to the body as well. Yep, to the spleen right there. He needs to stay in this position. He needs to pace himself. Knees to the upper thigh would be really good to do right now. What about swiveling into north-south position with some knees to the head, boss? Is that effective at this stage, or is it still because of his heavier weight? Yeah, but you know, I I don't think that Haritanov is going to let him. <laughs> he's going to with his he's going to stick his right arm up, and he says, no, 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 north south. I think Alistair really should concentrate now on throwing knees, really with the kneecap, to the thighs of Haritanov. He's cross-facing Haritanov oh, now. A There's a knee, knee to the head. Nice knee again. Yes, the long limbs, one of the taller fighters. Pride fighting championships at 6'5". In fact, not much of a height difference here. He should cross-face him more, and he should put more pressure on, because otherwise the referee is going to come in and he's going to restart him. And all Heratonov is trying to do here is hold him at close quarters, choke out any advantage that Green might try to achieve. Yep, I'm telling you, knees to the legs, underestimated. Knees nice to elbow to the, to the body, body, driving the air out of Sergey Heratonov, and that has to take its toll, boss. Yeah, but a guy like Sergey Heratonov, he's a tough guy, man. And in the end, they're all human. No, but you're right. They're coming from Russia, seriously working with the military. And let's not forget that Russian top team, that's where Fyodor Emelianenko cut his teeth in mixed martial arts. Good knee there. And what you said before, those elbows are uh, taking the toll because Haritanov started to defend them with his left leg. There's some hammer fist delivered by Alistair Overeem. He should cross face him and get out. Push himself away from him. And you could see they are taking their toll because Heratonov now trying to lift his left leg there when Overeem was going back to the body with those elbows, but now it's another knee strike. Good knee there. Man, those elbows. And you yep. can see the discoloring on the side of Heratonov's body. Yep. Just digging the point of the elbow into his rib cage area there, the spleen, as you mentioned, boss. Yep, but he needs to do a little bit more work, I think, in order for the referee not to stand him up. Of course, Alistair Overeem really coming into his own at the 2005 Pride Middleweight Tournament with a great showing as Sergei Heratonov did in the 2004 Pride Heavyweight Tournament. So each of these fighters still very young in their careers and lots of potential, boss. Yeah, both great fighters. Alistair really, I'm telling you again, he should concentrate on some knees to the body. Bring that arm down. Make sure that Haritanov is going to defend it and then go for that nice knee though there. Is Haritanov, looks like he may be cut, boss, after those uh, series of knee strikes, maybe bleeding from the nose, the yeah, mouth? Just the mouth of the nose, nothing big. That's why. But one thing, 
you have to be impressed with boss and followers of mixed martial arts and fans of Alistair Overeem. He is pacing himself, very methodical, not expending any unnecessary energy right now. Which is a lesson that he took from the last fight he had against Mauricio Shogun. And indeed, he had Shogun in his patented guillotine. Shogun now goes to the full oh, mount. Look at this. Can he keep it, maintain it? This is where Fyodor Emelianenko gave him some pointers in Holland. Nice, nice call. Oh, and the guillotine. No, right away back to the side. Mark, beautiful. He should, again, Haritanov, he should watch out now. Haritanov has the right arm underneath him, so he wants to try to escape the back door, although he's in the corner, so he can't. You see, he locked himself up in the corner. He cannot escape the back door now. Things could not have gone better for Alistair Overeem thus far here in round number one, bulking up to 228 pounds, and now decimating Sergei Haritanov with a series of knee strikes to the head. Yeah, but he, midway through round number one. He should pace himself because Haritanov is blocking those shots. Although, with his face. No, no, a lot of them. Yeah, no, with his face. It's over! Alistair Overeem has recorded the win over Sergei Haritanov! Whoa! Unbelievable! What a victory!